Hey guys, I took that uh, carcass bits and pieces of bone from that uh, chicken pot pie I made the other day and now I'm gonna make some chicken soup. So right here in my my crock pot I've got four cups of water and the carcass of that chicken I used for my pot pie. Other ingredients I'm going to add, let me move over here, are garlic salt, black pepper, green beans, half to a whole onion, a whole tomato, sliced up potato or potato, half jalapeno pepper or a whole one, it's up to you, some uh, garlic, I've got five cloves there, and one chicken bouillon cube. Those are the ingredients I'm going to put in once I get this thing boiling. So uh, we'll be back. Okay over here I diced up the tomatoes, sliced the onion in half, quartered the potatoes, and the garlic, well I still need to cut that or chop that up. And here's still my one chicken bouillon cube and half a jalapeno with the seeds removed. So I'll add these ingredients in about another hour. This is a crock pot so it's slow, it's a slow cooker. So I'll add these ingredients in another hour, hour and a half. And uh, right now I've got it on high heat so this chicken soup should be ready in about two to three hours. Hey guys, all right it's been boiling for about two hours. Oops. Clear up camera and what I'm gonna do now is add the tomatoes, the potatoes, the jalapeno, garlic, onion, and the bouillon cube. Uh, I'm going to add that into the pot right now. Hope I could do this with one hand, please. Good. Okay, so everything's in there. And I'm going to add a can of green beans with the, I'm not going to drain it. I'm going to, oops, getting cloudy again. I'm just going to pour the whole can with the uh, the water, if that's what you call it, in it. So I put the whole can of beans with the water. Okay, uh, salt, garlic salt. I'll go ahead and put some garlic salt in here. And, of course, my black pepper. It's quite a bit, but that's okay. It's a pretty big pot of chicken stock soup. So, we'll just uh, 
let it sit here for another hour and we'll, we'll taste it afterwards and we'll be all set for lunch or dinner. Be right back. Okay, I added more seasoning. So let's uh, let's wait another. Uh, I'd say another forty-five minutes to one hour before it's ready. And there you go guys, I put it in a bowl and uh, I did add some poultry seasoning, just uh, a dash, not that much, but here's the finished product and I've got a lot left, a lot left and uh, I'm going to have it with some, uh, some toast. So let's take a bite into this and see how it tastes. Ooh, piping hot. Let's see, let's get some potato in here. Okay. And here we go. Mmm. Very good. On a uh, cold day like today, it's in the 40s, and this is perfect, and didn't cost much. I just used the uh, carcass of the chicken that I made the uh, pot pie with. It's fabulous. Got some toast over there. Very healthy, very nutritious. Still piping hot. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, so good. So. So you've got the recipe. You can, uh, play around with ingredients. You could add uh, corn, you can uh, add, you could substitute uh, ingredients, uh, whatever you like, and uh, concoct your own soup. But these are the basic ingredients, the most important being the uh, chicken carcass and and your vegetables and your seasoning that's it well thanks for watching i'll see you all later bye bye